Quick video for you today. I'm making some armatures, so I thought that I could share with you the process and some tips. Let's go! Something that I find very important is to draw or print your puppet at real scale. That way you can see if your design of the armature fits inside the puppet, inside the silhouette. The front view is the most important to work with. You have to work with the arms and legs completely extended to have the right measurements. Here you can see that this joint doesn't fit in the design. This one is also really really close to touch the edges. So for this particular case, I will use a really really tiny hinge joint like the ones that you can find in the glasses and that way I will fit inside the measurements of this puppet. It's the first time that I'm using those parts to make hinge joints. I'm not sure if they will work fine or not. They are so tiny. Also, I don't know if it will be easy to solder them with silver soldering, but we'll find out. This one is the test that I soldered before to test if it works or not and to see if it fits in dimensions and it does. That's why you want to print the puppet design in real scale so you can lay out everything here in place. It's better to use joints to measure everything and the uh, big rule is measure twice and cut once. different ways to approach to an armature. One of them is like getting all the joints from a supplier and then solder all the puppet. And the second approach is by making yourself all the joints. That's a, a lot more work but you can design whatever you want. What I really do is a mix of those two options. I use a standard joints and I also make my own joints. Okay, this is a setup ready to solve the hinge joint. Now I will use the torch here and let's see how it works. Finally the arms are ready. I really like this design because you can fold the arm like so but you can also twist. I really like these tiny tiny parts from the glasses. I think they work really really nice. 
it's pretty difficult to silver solder them because they are so tiny but once you get the way you can make the soldering it works pretty smooth that's it for today hope you like the process on making this little arm if you like this video and my content please subscribe click the bell to be aware of new videos if you have any question leave it down below in the comments and if you want to help the channel visit my patreon there you can find the stickers that's it peace